In this video, we will be discussing the pros and cons of renting versus buying a home. Whether you're a first-time home buyer, a renter looking to make a change, or simply curious about the different options available to you, it's important to understand the benefits and drawbacks of each. Renting and buying a home both have their own unique set of advantages and disadvantages. Renting may be more affordable in the short term, but buying a home allows you to build equity and potentially see a return on your investment in the long term. On the other hand, buying a home comes with higher upfront costs and the responsibility for maintenance and repairs. It's important to weigh the pros and cons of both options before making a decision, as the right choice will depend on your individual circumstances and financial goals. We will be covering all of these aspects in this video, so that you can make an informed decision that works best for you. Pros of Renting One of the main pros of renting a home is flexibility. As a renter, you typically have the ability to move more easily and quickly than if you were a homeowner. This can be especially beneficial for those who may need to relocate for work or other reasons. Another major benefit of renting is that it generally requires lower upfront costs. When you rent a home, you typically only need to pay a security deposit, first month's rent, and possibly a small application fee. This is in contrast to buying a home, where you'll need to come up with a down payment, closing costs, and pay other fees. Renting also means that you have less responsibility when it comes to maintenance and repairs. As a renter, you don't have to worry about fixing leaks, replacing appliances, or maintaining the yard. Instead, those responsibilities fall on the landlord. This can be a significant advantage for those who may not have the time, skills or budget to handle these types of tasks. Overall, renting can be a great option for those who value flexibility, lower upfront costs, and less maintenance responsibility. However, it's important to remember that you'll be giving up some long-term benefits such as building equity or getting tax benefits that homeowners have. Cons of Renting While there are many benefits to renting a home, there are also some downsides to consider. One major con of renting is that you lack control over the property. As a renter, you are subject to the rules and regulations set by the landlord and don't have the freedom to make changes to the property as you wish, such as paint the walls, or adding a room. Another downside of renting is the limited tax benefits. As a renter, you don't have the same tax deductions available to homeowners, such as the mortgage interest deduction or property tax deductions. This means you may have to pay more in taxes overall. Additionally, renting does not provide the same long-term investment opportunities as buying a home. When you rent, you are essentially paying someone else's mortgage and not building equity in the property. While renting may be less expensive in the short term, it doesn't offer the same potential for long-term financial gain as buying a home. It's important to keep in mind that while renting can offer flexibility and lower upfront costs, it may not be the best choice for those looking for long-term investment opportunities or looking for a place to call it their own. Pros of Buying Buying a home can offer a number of benefits, including building equity, potential appreciation, and tax deductions. One of the main pros of buying a home is the ability to build equity. When you make a mortgage payment, a portion of that payment goes towards paying down the principal of the loan, which means you are building equity in the property. Over time, as you pay down the loan, the equity in the property grows, and you can use that equity as a financial resource if needed. Another benefit of buying a home is the potential for appreciation. If the value of the property increases over time, you can see a return on your investment when you go to sell the home. Real estate can be a good hedge against inflation as well. Additionally, buying a home can offer tax benefits. As a homeowner, you may be eligible for deductions on your income taxes, such as the mortgage interest deduction and property tax deductions. These deductions can help offset the costs of homeownership and lower your overall tax bill. Overall, Buying a home can be a great long-term investment that offers the potential for appreciation, the ability to build equity, and tax deductions. However, it's important to keep in mind that buying a home also comes with higher upfront costs, the need for a down payment and closing costs, and the responsibility for maintenance and repairs. 
Cons of Buying While there are many benefits to buying a home, there are also some downsides to consider, such as higher upfront costs, the need for a down payment in closing costs, and the responsibility for maintenance and repairs. One of the main cons of buying a home is the higher upfront costs. In addition to the purchase price of the home, you'll also need to come up with a down payment, which is typically a percentage of the purchase price. You'll also need to pay for closing costs, which can include things like loan origination fees, appraisal fees, and title insurance. These costs can add up quickly and can make buying a home less affordable for some people. Another downside of buying a home is the need for ongoing maintenance and repairs. As a homeowner, you are responsible for maintaining and repairing the property. This can be costly, especially if you are faced with unexpected repairs or major renovations. Additionally, buying a home can be a significant commitment, as it's usually a long-term decision and you may not be able to move as easily as a renter. This can be a disadvantage for those who want more flexibility or may need to move frequently. It's important to keep in mind that while buying a home can offer many long-term benefits, it also comes with higher upfront costs, ongoing maintenance and repairs responsibilities, and can be a significant long-term commitment. It's important to weigh these factors and consider your own personal circumstances before making a decision to buy. Other factors to consider. When deciding whether to rent or buy a home, there are other factors to consider beyond the pros and cons of each option. These include location, job stability, and family size. Location can play a big role in the decision to rent or buy a home. For example, if you're living in an area with a high cost of living, buying a home may be less affordable than renting. Additionally, if you're living in an area with a high rental demand, it may be more cost-effective to buy a home. Job stability is another important factor to consider. If you're in a field where you may have to relocate frequently, renting may be a better option than buying. This can also be true if you're not sure where you'll be living or working in the long term. Family size is another consideration. If you have a growing family, a house may be more suitable than an apartment, however, it also comes with more responsibilities and costs. On the other hand, if you're single or a couple without kids, a smaller apartment or a condo may be more suitable and more affordable. Ultimately, the decision to rent or buy a home will depend on your individual circumstances, including your financial situation, lifestyle, and long-term goals. It's important to consider all the factors mentioned above and do your research before making a decision.